traffic deaths climbed again in Los Angeles last year, with 300 people killed on city streets, the highest number in at least two decades, said city officials. According to Los Angeles Police Department data, 312 people were killed in traffic collisions last year, 5% more than in 2021 and a 29% increase over 2020. S streets remain particularly deadly for pedestrians and bicyclists, with 159 people killed in collisions involving pedestrians and motorists, a 19% rise compared with 2021, and 20 people killed in collisions involving bicyclists and motorists, an 11% rise. The traffic carnage in L. In 2022 outpaced national trends. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration reported that nationwide fatalities from traffic crashes were essentially flat in the first nine months of 2022 compared with 2021. Fatalities among cyclists and pedestrians rose nationwide last year but were lower than the percentage rise seen in L. A. The L figures dismayed activist groups who've long urged City Hall to devote more funding and staff towards Vision Zero, the city's program to end traffic fatalities by 2025. It's frustrating and infuriating, said Damian Kevitt, executive director of the nonprofit group Streets Are For Everyone. All of these fatalities are preventable. Connie Lanos, interim general manager of the L Transportation Department, said Angelinos need to recognize that how we drive can either save lives or take them, 